Today we've done a demonstration on the Weed Technics thermal unit that we're using throughout the Ray Landscapes contract for pavement weed control. Council's looking to phase out glyphosate. You can't use the fatty acid organic sprays on pavement weed control because they're toxic to marine life. So they've been looking for alternatives to replace glyphosate and thermal seems to be the best option at this point. Christchurch City Council is big on bringing in rain gardens to help filter the water before it goes into the stormwater and we're not allowed to use any chemicals in rain gardens. So along with pavement weed control, the rain gardens are another area we can definitely use it. And we're also looking at using it on graffiti and also cleaning playgrounds. We can steam clean playgrounds at the same time. So it's got a lot of uses. We carry 2,000 litres of water. That water moves towards the diesel burner and that heats the water. And you see the application where the operator and it's coming out of the applicator head. That water's coming out at 120 degrees. It's so hot that it's killing the plant. Previous attempts at thermal weed control, the water was coming out at 90 to 100 degrees, which wasn't enough to knock the plant back. But this time it's too hot for the cells and they explode and then we're killing the weeds. With the superheated water coming out, it quite visually changes the, the leaf colour. So it starts out a, like a light green colour and as you apply it sort of about three to five seconds, you can see it change to like a darker colour and it wilts down quite obviously as well, especially on uh, fleshier leaf type weeds. It does take longer to actually treat the weeds. You need to hold the applicator head over the weed for a bit longer. So in that sense, it's, it's a bit slower, but it's still a very, very effective way of doing it. When you treat it properly, it definitely does not bounce back. We're eradicating that seed bank every time, so we should get less and less weed growth. Where glyphosate, we continually get that regrowth because you're actually not removing the seed bed, so that could be a really big benefit going forward. With the traditional glyphosate, we get eight weeks of uh, weed eradication. Uh, with thermal at this point, we're looking at around about four to five weeks, and that will reduce as we continue to use the product. It's been better than expected. You see best results after about four days, but with some of the larger weeds, it seems to melt the weed straight away, which is fantastic. So we're seeing some relatively quick results, which is pleasing. Innovation was a big part of the new contract, and we see this as a, as a great innovation, removing chemicals, far more environmentally friendly, and it's something that Council has a mandate to reduce glyphosate, so it fits all the criteria. We will eventually end up with uh, more units, and we'll cover all of the uh, pavement weed control, and that will replace the glyphosate that's been traditionally used.